Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Julia and this is Stitching Up Disney. Today is my last video of the year and I am so excited to, set, to show you some things and give you a heads up on what's up for next year and um, a few finds that I found today at the Walmart. I'm so excited to show you. Um, first of all, this was something that I got for Christmas from my son Lucius. He brought me the pop figure of Doug uh, 1093. I was screamed out in our driveway because he tried to sneak and act like he didn't bring me nothing, which I never expect my kids to bring me anything. But Doug is adorable. I'm going to add him to my up collection. Super excited about this. He is adorable. I'm going to keep him in the box until we move, though, because I want to make sure everything doesn't get all messed up. Put him back later. And then I also got this little guy. I'm not going to take him out of the box just yet. I will later and put him in my background, but I was super excited to get this from my husband. And it has the necklace that you can wear yourself, which is going to stay on my grow group. And then it's got the soup bowl, the frog, and the, the little ball. But it's super cute. And I've been wanting one of these for a while. And my husband delivered. As always, he bends over backwards to make me happy. Then I also picked up this, which... I'm going to do Vlogmas next year for Christmas because I'm going to be in the 25 card swap again. And I want to do some things a little different. But I found this. It was half off at the Walmart about a week or so ago. So I'm going to do that. And then also starting tomorrow, I'm going to start my new journey on wellness. And I'm going to use the little book that Clipper and Kitten sent me. And I haven't written in it yet. I'm going to start planning that probably tonight. But I look forward to sharing that journey with y'all because I do got to lose some weight and so does my husband. So we're going to start that out starting tomorrow. It's not a New Year's, year, New Year's resolution. It's just we got to do something better because we're getting older. But then also I have two of these that was in my stocking. Then I'm going to open up. I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then I'm going to show you what I found today at the Walmart for 75% off. It comes with a little booklet. I got two in this pack. I love Disney Dorables. I love anything small. It's just cute. And I got the dragon from Raya. And then I got the Flocked Pooh Bear. And then I have one more. Whoops. Oh, and this one has three. Let's see which ones I got here. I have two that I can see through in a blind bag. I got another dwarf, and I believe this one is sleepy. And then I have a mermaid already, and I believe this one is a different one. This is the Little Mermaid in her. I don't know what my camera's doing. Sorry about that, guys. This is Belle in her blue dress with her beautiful blue bow on the back. So cute. And then for the blind bag one, I got a flocked Eeyore. So cute. Now, for the items that I got today, I want to show you. These were 75 off. I got the Woody ornament. 
my man, the Darth Vader. My man, Jack. These, I think, come up to $1.99, this, this kind here. I got Lock, Shock, and Barrel. And I got Araya. That was those. And then, these were a little over $2.00. These are the pop. This one is Jack. I got a Deadpool, which my son loves. I got Voltamort, however you say it. These was so exciting to find for 75 off. I got a Sally. Run out places to put these. I got a, this is not Disney, but he's super cute. Gizmo with the 3D glasses. And then I got Harry from Harry Potter, or Harry Potter. I got another one that reminds me of my son. And this is Spider-Man. I got another not Disney elf, Buddy the Elf. Fixing to have an avalanche of Christmas ornaments. And then I got the child, Baby Grow Grow Grew, which my husband found. It was on a top shelf, and of course I'm very short and I can't see. I was super excited when he pulled that one down. <laughs> and there they go. And then I got, these were $1.49. They had Stitch in his Hawaiian shirt with a lay. Adorable. And then the last one is Oogie Boogie. These were like $1.49. So I racked up. My husband said, you got more stuff than I did for my birthday. But my husband loves me and he thought these was a steal, so we had to get them. Excuse me. <coughs> but I I do have some other things that I want to show you. Excuse me <coughs> again. <coughs> a little strangled. <coughs> I make Disney ears. And this is a pair that I've recently made. And it's got Chewbacca as Winnie the Pooh and a little Porg as Piglet. And it says... Wookie the Pooh and Porklet too. I, was, I made these that I have on as well. Excuse the way I look. We are cooking for this evening for New Year's Eve. And I just didn't have time to get all dolled up. But um, here's another pair of ears. This is what I like to make. This has Roz and it's Smoochie Poo. I'm going. I'm in the year of the ear, and I love to make ears. I do sell my ears on Instagram. If anybody's interested in a custom-made pair of ears, you can message me on Instagram at Stitching Up Disney. But what I also want to talk about before I jump off here is um, I have a board back here, and it's what you're doing for New Year's Day. Um, our tradition is to eat greens, black eyed peas, and um. What, we, what I call us fat back, but because I'm country, but hog jaw, we eat that tomorrow. Um, at midnight tonight, we're going to do the 12 grapes, eat a grape at each time of midnight. So that's something fun that we do. And But today we're doing turkey and sweet potatoes and stuff like that just because we like to eat around here. And also on Instagram, I had placed up a picture of my bacon crack that I always make during the holidays. Besides, my husband makes cheesecakes, and everybody loves those. We're not doing the cheesecake, but I made bacon crack, and there's a picture on Instagram. But uh, what I'd like to know is, what do y'all do for your tradition for New Year's Eve and New Year's Day? So what are y'all doing New Year's Day? Comment down below and let me know what y'all do, and... If you do the same thing we do, you know, to bring luck, and it's just a fun tradition, and it's a good meal.
but I hope everybody has a wonderful, safe New Year's Eve and a I'm so ready for 2022. I I just can't wait for something new to happen. Next, this coming up year, my husband graduates from college and is going to start a new career. And we're hoping to move to Florida. So, fingers crossed all that works out well because I'm ready to get out of this town and get closer to the parks. But I hope everybody has a wonderful evening, a happy new year, stay safe, and I will see y'all next year in my next video. Love you guys.